Zamba and Blue Striker going at it. Will it be the New York native uh, from Staten Island or the Texas native coming in and invading and taking Zeno? Would not be the first invader to win a Zeno. Would be one of a very few that has taken a Zeno in the past. It, yeah, it's definitely not been that many. Usually, New York does an excellent job of holding it down, so now Zamba has to defend the turret, but that is proving to be quite difficult with the way that Blue Shrek is already just so dominantly controlling a lot of the space that Zamba wants to be occupying. Nice, and the oh. chase so good uh, from uh, Zamba, waiting for that option to come off ledge. Blue Striker, though, very, very patient, stays on ledge, doesn't get hit by that Nair, and gets back to stage, gets some damage. Zamba's, I, I like the position and, and, and just relative to Sonic, where Zamba is putting himself. He's not too close. He's putting himself just a little bit further back so that he can put out a lot of preemptive hitboxes, especially like neutral. Zamba able to escape that really dangerous position where many have fallen before him. Wow, and a huge call out by Zamba there on the grab, getting into advantage. Ooh, Ooh. not getting that scoop hitbox. I love how we both had the same visceral reaction to that. Uh, yeah, Blue Shrekker just would have waited for that. No! Reversal! Huge by Zamba. That's massive. And I think one thing that we are going to be seeing here that we did not see in the past sets is this is a hard matchup for Sonic. A genuinely really tough matchup for Sonic. Because those other characters want to set up a wall, and that wall takes a while to set up. Rob's wall I is I click down the down B. B button. I click the down B button and boom, there <laughs> it goes. Uh, and, and Jago is like, as soon as it's out there, it's going to be controlling a lot of the space. The real opening for Blue Strike, who is like, hey, if both of us are on one side of the stage and Jago is on the other, this is my go time. I need to keep you off uh, as long as possible. Or if Sonic, for some reason, has Jago, or if Jago is just not out to begin with. But as soon as Jago is out and wow. occupying the stage, that is when Rob controls your space. And I would love to see Zamba here uh, challenging, ooh, that is a pretty safe, or relatively safe move on block. Zamba not jumping, but does jump there. And uh, Blue Striker is ready with the back air. Still no jump from Zamba and running low on fuel. Uh, Sonic has so many good ways to pressure, but an excellent late air dodge by Zamba to get back to the floor. And there was a lot that just happened. I feel like Zamba wanted to go for an up smash out of shield, was not able to find it. And now just sort of going for a lot of mix ups out of shield. I love that. Um, because oh. he's sort of anticipating Blue Shrekker's next option, but that's going to be another upper right up at the top, able to close that one out. So as Rob, how do you pin down Sonic fast enough to be able to find this kill? And really, it's going to be a lot about this corner game. Blue Striker able to get out there, but Zamba uh, still continuing to pressure with down tilt. Uh, that is a huge amount of damage, though. 42% um, for Sonic is big, 50 even bigger. And we are just seeing some devastating damage coming out right now for Blue Striker, looking poised to take this game number one. Rob has a lot of trouble getting back down. However, that back are going to help uh, out Zamba. That Nair still won't take it either, even if Zamba does land it. Ooh, Blue Striker going, oh! going so deep. And that Gyro <laughs> ends up setting him right under the lip of Pokemon Stadium, too. He might live to regret that. Yeah, I mean, this is a situation where we have seen in the past what Zamba can do with a gyro in hand. However, uh, Ooh, scary situation. Wow. Living. Rob's heavy. Rob is indeed heavy. Zamba going through every single high recovery mix up that he could manage. <gasps> Oh, and finds that narrow hitbox to be able to land. This is so big for Zamba because now he has a lot of rage to his name. He is out of those percent combos for Sonic. What hit? Back air. Back that air? was back air on a trade with Nair. Oh, wow. Uh, ooh. Ooh. How did that happen? Yeah, Funny. the one screen on your mic popped out. Yeah. Uh, with that said, yeah, a, see this. a trade on, uh, on back air with Nair. Uh, Zamba going for that full hop Nair. They're actually la okay. landing down with, with uh, Nair. Okay, 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 okay. Oh my god, maybe I'm a little bit too early here on, on clicking this. I just want to see this one more time. Yeah. Oh. A landing there. Wow. Coming out and... Um, so why did Zamba die? That's what I That's what I want to know. Why did Zamba die? Because it really does seem like he could... <gasps> did he do actual air dodge up? Was that his last choice? No, because I that didn't look like a double jump. He did not have a double jump. He used a double jump to, to get to the ground. Uh, and then right here. Let's go, let's go take a look. I'm just curious what Zamba did. That looks like a directional air dodge up, doesn't it? It's, hard, it's so hard to tell. But it does look like an air dodge. It looks like invincibility frames are out. Yeah. yeah that is an air, that was a good eye, Dara. Thank that was you. That's impressive. That's tough as well. But you don't have anything to <laughs> yeah. like cancel your horizontal momentum immediately. So even though that you're that heavy and like you quote unquote should be able to live that long, normally your double jump yeah. is the best thing to be able to cancel the horizontal momentum that you're uh, receiving. 
death. Ooh, manages to still get it despite the air dodge. It's hype when Zamba does it. I swear, guys. <laughs> I love Rob. Rob is sick. Speaking of, Rob is sick. Also outside of shield, Zamba, the great awareness on side B there. How Blue Striker went about using it. Ooh. He was not able to cross up successfully, but as a result, Zamba now just keeping Blue Striker uh, off stage with this excellent reversal. Love the delay with the neutral B, was just able to wait out Zamba's next option. Both of them keep exchanging control of the stage. Um, Blue Striker ends up hitting with Zamba back on, keeps side being back on. They keep on ping ponging back and forth. And we've seen so far, Zaba has taken this in a little bit more of a patient way, I would say. Um, has waited for it to jump while recovering. Has waited to either go high or low while getting back to the stage. Waited on ledge a little bit longer. And I would like to see that continue from Zamba. It's been incredibly effective so far um, when you really don't have too much time to react to what um, Sonic is going to do. You let Sonic do something first, then you can choose your option. Yeah, but Zamba's keep away game right now is just so good. When you do have that lead against Sonic, you can just sort of stay back at long to mid distance, press out those, you know, preemptive projectiles and hitboxes, and you know what? He can't initiate. What's he going to do? Cross up your shield again? Um, and eventually, he'll just keep on getting hit. Death, but yeah. yeah, pushing in a little bit too far with that final dash attack, Blue Striker taking full opportunity and closes that stock. And we've seen so far that, um, again, Sonic does tend to struggle uh, when it, uh, Rob has that advantage. But with that said, um, Blue Striker certainly uh, does not play the Sonic game uh, by staying back, as many Sonics would. Has stayed in the face of all of the combatants that he has faced so far. Tech Chase, excellent done, done by Zamba. Yeah, but tech rolling in there is so smart because if you teched in place or even maybe tech rolled out and you got hit by the edge of down smash, uh, you might have died. Yeah. However, if you got hit by the one that's sending you to the opposite side, that yeah, I took damage, but oh my, oh no. And that is huge. That is a early, early stock oh, he's for running. Blue Striker. <gasps> oh, that but then death. just ends up air dodging yeah. back into Zamba and Zamba finds that down to go into up smash. This is now anybody's game to take. Now, an interesting uh, piece of information that you can get out of that uh, right there is that at 150, down throw up smash hit. That is not typical to what we have seen out of many other New York competitors like John Numbers who are getting out of that forever. Yeah. Zamba can take advantage of that. And I want to see if Zamba is aware um, and can start doing those down throws a little bit earlier around that 100% mark, around that uh, 110, 120% mark to get those up airs to take those stocks a little bit earlier. <gasps> oh, tries to go for the up air, but a little bit too far to the left and was not able to get the hit into the second one. Um, Blue Shaker had the good idea, but needed to be a little bit more inside of Rob's uh, model. And so far, that, that, that up air could prove incredibly costly. Zamba's done an excellent job of keeping Blue Striker in the corner. However, a reversal coming out from uh, Blue Striker, that Nair. Well, Zamba maybe tries to catch like a preemptive air dodge down. Is not going to be able to find it. Blue Striker is so patient at the ledge because all he's doing, he is stalling with uh, the moves that he can use to get back onto the stage. He's stalling, he's waiting, he sees back here. That's his opening to get back on as soon as that move dissipates. Wow. Does it, oh, oh, oh! And got around the back air, and that's a reset. Look at the movement. He did it again. All he was doing, he was waiting for Zamba to press back here again. He 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 sat in this position right here. This is this is it. This is this is where he, you know it's make or break. He sees Rob in all of this end leg, so you know what he does? He takes this as the opportunity to be able to jump back in. And now that is a Sonic jumping on your shield while you're stuck and sitting in it. And you can see Zamba react to the jump and tries to get back in time and get that back air out. But Sonic is already past him by the time he's able to yeah. react. Yeah. And Sonic gets that back air out. Also, that's like who got back in. That's yeah. slow. It's slow. Even with the auto spacing, you know, moving Rob backward, Rob is still large. So yeah. Rob's going to get hit there. And it is an excellent job done. Oh, we got Link. We got Link in grand choice. finals of Zeno. I, I haven't seen the Zamba Link in a minute. It's been a hot sec, for sure. Um, However, I don't, uh, I'm not opposed to trying this out, being that the Rob has struggled, especially in that game one, even though game two was incredibly close. Um, the Link Ooh. is certainly something worth trying, I think, in the game two, and then worst case, switching back to Rob might not be a bad idea, seeing where you're at with this Link, however. But look how Blue Shaker is just not even letting Zamba get a boomerang out right now. He's just able to hit past it, he's able to get in there. He doesn't even have to worry about neutral that much. All he's doing is he's waiting for Zamba to press. And really, it's been that similar problem that we've seen with other zoners. 
um, against Sonic. And that's that Sonic just has that incredible burst strange. Gets past the zoners' walls well. they want to set up. Town and City helping Zamba out there. Yeah, that's not going to take it quite yet, but the next one definitely will. Blue Strike who finds that aggressive landing. Um, that's going to be like a nice back hill at this point. Uh, or he maybe tries to find a way to get Zamba off stage. Oh. If there is one thing, however, that Link most certainly is, I was about to say it's a rage monster, but uh, rage no longer a question here. Blue Striker takes that stock number one and is looking very, very good. That so was oh, dragged down up here into the ground. Shmix. That's going to be the back to go. Tries to catch the logo cover, Death? but Zamba with a beautiful <laughs> reversal. That's the lonesome. That's the classic. And, uh. and Zamba quickly is able to find that stock. Never underestimate B reversed up B from Link because that move cheats. That, uh, that move, move is an action that's replay. A, that's a strong move. And uh, really, it was necessary by Zamba, because Zamba was down by a whole lot there. And with that said, still down by a whole lot. Gets back down to the floor, that boomerang ending up sniping up the uh, initial side B. Second side B gets uh, through, though, and hits Zamba, looking for a way in. Now is Blue Striker. A Blue Striker can yeah, get a forward. couple of nails, and Blue Striker missing that tech on the platform, just sitting idle for uh, Zamba to throw out a boomerang. This is such a nasty position to be in, but the way that Zamba is just like covering all the spaces that Blue Striker wants to be occupying, so, so good. He's just not, I mean, you know, he's just cloning him. Yeah, and really it's, oh, well that's gotta be a missing but um, And nearly a costly one for Zamba. Uh, manages to get back, but uh, that F-Tail coming out so good in these past few sets has that F-Tail been at catching the recoveries back to stage for Blue Striker. He's I, just I, waiting. I, Zamba's yeah. pressing those buttons preemptively. 61. Oh man. This is looking rough for our hero of time. Um, and Zamba, despite the fact that New York is on the verge of losing um, Zeno by an invader, uh, going to need a whole lot of data, a whole lot of information to prove um, the ability to come back here. 97%. Uh, we're going very likely into this game number two very soon. However, Zamba, you know, again, as I mentioned, Link, Rage Monster, can do this. Zamba will be tough. Zamba is committing a lot. He's pressing up B's, he's pressing That's a it. lot of smash attacks. No, wow. no, Link just has just enough drift. Um, he needs to play a little bit more patiently and press those buttons um, in, in in a way that, like, even if he whiffs it, he might have enough time to land and shield. Uh, because Zamba's going through, like, a lot of slow and active ones. And, and it's so tough because Sonic really can just wait out a lot of those Link approaches, yeah. as we've seen in the past. That Nair is so good. Nice tech by Zamba. Ooh, but rinse and repeat. Zamba doesn't have those bomb recoveries. Wow. Oh, but Blue Shaker not anticipating the last hitbox of Upbeat. That's going to give Zamba the coverage that he needs. So, listen, one good down tilt in the corner at like 20 more percent. Yeah. All, all you need is one more boomerang, one more arrow. Uh, get that damage on. And then, I mean, hitting the down tilt is going to be the problem. That's going to be death. Yeah. Almost. Not yeah, quite no. just yet. Mm -hmm. And again, just trying to follow Zamba on the way down using Upbeat. Not in the right position to be able to cover goal. Is that going to be able to do it? Yes, yes it is. Zamba flustered maybe a little bit there. Again, three straight games for being in Grand certainly uh, cause for concern for Zamba. Um, we're going to be seeing what the adaptation is. I imagine we're going to be going back to Rob. I cannot imagine we're going to be staying Link in this next game. Maybe Roy? Uh, could be Roy. But I, it's tough because now you're boxing with Sonic. Now we're not playing around with the zoners anymore. We're going back to Rob. Okay. Yeah. That's the right choice. Jaguar so. does a lot. Zamba was able to find his kills a little bit easier, but also he just had like a better sense of like what he should be pressing to sort of keep away Sonic. Zamba looks a bit flustered. Yeah, it's 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 been a tough go of it, uh, and again, it's a lot of this is I feel as though does New York have this matchup experience? Um, frankly, no, right? Yeah. And it, it's been uh, kind of a tough deal for these you know New York players who are so good with their traditional zoners, that dealing with a character that has the burst option and who, a player who is as aggressive as Blue Striker has been incredibly difficult uh, for many of our players to deal with. Ooh, and Zamba, Death. as soon as he gets a little bit of momentum for oh. himself, that's all he needs. One Jago combo is going to be able to close it out. Blue Striker tried to go high, but Zamba covered it in time. And it ends up working out for Zamba there. Very fortunate um, that they got, got that guess correct. Um, and it is going to be a huge stock for Zamba in establishing a lead here. Mm -hmm. uh, something that you absolutely need to do versus Sonic. That's going to be a death. 
No, Ooh, not no. quite. Yeah, no, not Sonic quite. Sonic needs rage. That's right. Sonic needs a bit of rage. He also needs to be a little bit closer to the edge. Uh, sometimes Blue Striker does go for like that uh, up B into a second one. Um, but he wasn't really looking for it this time around. Ooh. He's trying to be so patient the way that he's getting off of this corner right now. And I, I think one of the bigger issues that I've seen with Zamba in this set when recovering high with Rob has been the instant use of jump to get high. Yeah. And really, Blue Striker has been calling that out. Uh, Rob is one of those characters that has so much mix with recovery. However, going high every time puts Rob in a really vulnerable situation. Mm -hmm. He doesn't have the greatest hitboxes below him to not get anti-air. Nair is great. Oh my, <gasps> tries to go for it all, but still in a position to be able to get back onto the stage. Is Blue Shaker gonna go for this juggle? Oh man. And it's a huge uh, percent comeback for Blue Shaker right now. And yep. it, oh no, no gas. Yeah, no gas, that's just perfect force wave. the directional air dodge, and of course, because you can't immediately snap, you're stuck in the end lag. But even if you sweet spot it, it's, it, the window is much more than a two frame as you stall out, of course, so. An excellent wait there by Zamba uh, for that second fair to come out. Gets up right into it. Air dodge is out. That co that's costly. Mm -hmm. yeah, the Zamba deserved to land that one, so you know that directional <laughs> air dodge, it was fine. Ah, that's the, what it was. the move behind Rob gets smaller over time. Fun mm. fact. Um, but yes, so Zamba looking at. <gasps> and that's it. That's how he ends, you know. I, I, once again, a jump and an uppy call out, and it is the invader. What, Blue Sun? Blue Striker. 65% on Rob. And that's going to be game. And again, it's these high recoveries that Zamba has done that have been so, so costly. And a cross up on the DI, actually, as well. was was, was Zamba was kept going high in unsafe positions. And, and Blue Striker was just able to track that so well. But think about it this way. Let's say you want to go back to the ledge. You get hit by side B, forwarder, forwarder, you're also done. It has truly been a, uh, a clinic by Blue Striker in the loser's bracket. Yeah. And one thing I want to say, if you want to learn how to edge guard as Sonic the Hedgehog, Watch everything that Blue Striker yeah. just did. 